Hello and welcome to Old Lady Plays. I'm Kate, the old lady, and this is To Dare Is To Do, episode 52 of A Spurs Save. And how's it been going? Well, in fact, let's go have a look at the schedule. You last saw us playing Real Madrid and Stoke. We beat Fulham 3-1. Cameron Carter-Vickers got his first goal. Um, I think... Oh, no, that's his second goal. There's one back here, too. That's his second goal for the club. Uh, Nardo Silva and then um, Kasper Dolberg got the third goal. Eriksson and Gnabry. Uh, Son Hung min broke his leg and will be out for the rest of the season. So... Um, you'll see Dolberg getting to play more because he's subbing in on left wing where um, Son Hung Min was. And uh, so we beat Chelsea 2-0 at their park. Blackburn 3-0 at home. West Brom 4-0 at home. Dolberg with a brace in this one after a single in the previous game. Then Harry Kane grabbed one while both wingers grabbed a brace. Um, Lucas Mora has been really on fire this season. He's up to, I think, 12 goals. He's had two hat-tricks, 11 goals, 9 in the Premier Division, 2 in the Carabao Cup. So he's done very well. Great um, assist generator as well. So anyway, um, that's Blackburn. We beat West Brom in the FA Cup. 4-0, no real question there. We beat West Ham 5-2, as I said, uh, in the Carabao Cup semi-final first match. And then uh, Villa just yesterday, or just last week, I should say, um, with a hat-trick from Harry Kane and a penalty and a goal from uh, Christian Eriksen. So we've been pretty much thumping the opposition, as you can see. Um, it's It's been a pretty solid run. We're on an eight game winning streak. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight so far. And now we have Liverpool, our big rivals. Today's team will be Pickford, Trippier, Benkovic, Alderweireld and Davis. Why am I starting Alderweireld? Um, he's been playing really well. And Sanchez has been um, quite heavily used lately, so we're going to let uh, Toby have a go. Toby's still quite good. He's he's kept his pace relatively well. He's down to 12, I think that says. Um, it's a little hard to read. I mean, it's deliberately hard to read, but it's hard to read. Um, yeah, so he's still playing reasonably well for us, so I thought we'd let him have the chance. Ben Davis, Getson Fernandez, Christopher Iyer, Bernardo Silva, Christian Eriksen, and Serge Gnabry forming the attacking midfield line, and Harry Kane as the point of the spear. Um, Harry, as you can see, has 19 goals in 23 starts, so we're pretty happy with that. Um, let's roll. I think we say to the fans. Let's give the fans a performance. Well, that worked pretty well. I got half of them. The press are all bleating about contracts that are going to expire in 18 months because I haven't done anything about them yet. But the true fact is that I've just finished doing a huge wadge of um, staff contracts because they were all expiring this year, just dozens of them. Um, and um, also, we're we're on course to not make our financial fair play at the moment, so I'm not in a hurry to give anybody else a contract right now until that's been sorted out for the year. So. Oh, hit the post. Pickford is there. Oh, nice. 
nice try. I got four shots on target, that's good. Oh, I hadn't noticed till now they're going three at the back. Ooh. Hurry, keep your shots down, mate. Come on. You guys are better than this. Let's do this. Nothing out of the first half. The performance was not disappointing. I say we've been the better team here. Just keep doing what you've been doing, and we will be fine. Christopher Iyer is nervous. Let's see if we can make him... Not excited by that. Okay, I think we'll just leave it there. I mean, we've decidedly outplayed them. We've had better possession. We've had more shots. We've had more shots on target. Lucas Mora come in and Dele Alley. And I think for the third we'll bring in Rahman just to get that yellow card off the field. Looks like we're gonna dominate the game but not get much in the way of shots in in the way of goals. Disappointing draw. Uh, that's that's really disappointing. I'm gonna say you were unlucky because I thought they were. We should have been able to beat them. Still nine matches unbeaten. Sure, I do. Um, I'm not talking about Stoke. That'll do there. Um, when is the next game? It is in three days. All right. I will cut here and I will be back with a um, with the next part in just a moment from your point of view. See you then. And we're back. It's time for the West Ham match. Pick the team already. Pickford Aurier, Carter Vickers Sanchez, Rahman in the defense, Bentaleb and Dyer in the midfield with Mora, Ali, Dolberg in the attacking midfield, and Harry Kane up front. So that's going to be the setup. Um, we're ready to go. Let's roll. We're up 5-2 from the first leg, but away in the second. So they've got two away goals. I don't know whether that counts for anything or not. I didn't check. Um, there we go. That's what I want to see. A little bit of weather isn't going to... He's just being rested. There we go.
And West Ham start off with the ball, but gain nothing out of it. annoying. Well, that was an underwhelming first half. Nothing happened except Delhi getting his red card. That's not ideal. There. That's the one. That's the one to keep. Or a man down. Play intelligently, please. Not going very well. And definitely finding a little extra space out there. They're much more tired than we are, though. They just got beat for nothing by Bournemouth the other day. And I think they're paying the price because they look really tired. Crashed away. Didn't see who by. Hmm. I'm going to bring on Silva up front, and I'm going to swap him with Mora, who doesn't mind being a complete forward, so let's do that. What else? Anything else? People have been relatively good. How about we bring in Ericsson for Bentaleb, and we'll leave the rest for now. It doesn't look like they're going to come back on us at this point. Ten men or not. There's one. I need two more to draw it. Or win on away goals, if that's a rule. Waste a little time with another sub. Um, sure, Navri can come on for Dolberg. Nothing out of that one. Straight to the new guy, Navri. Erickson, nothing happens. We get through. I am happy. So, fairly low energy game that, but at least, um, 
anyway, that worked out. We got the got through to the final. And yeah, it'd be nice to win it again. I'm sure we'd have put my fight, yeah. Prove that here. With an ugly challenge. And return to the squad. And I think we're going to give him a warning on that one. And there we go. All right. That's going to do it for today. For today. For today. And when will we come back? I guess we'll come back for Napoli and the Carabao Cup final. That seems like a good place to start. And then we'll come back after that for Napoli and maybe an FA Cup match somewhere up in here. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But um, we're definitely going to be focusing on the Champions League on the rest of the way out. Um, and the Cup matches. We'll just keep on working on trying to win the Premier Division. We are two points clear after our draw with Liverpool. But six points clear of Liverpool. So... That's not bad, and we've got the edge in goal difference too. So we're in we're in reasonably good shape. I'm I'm not unhappy with this. Um, yeah. So we'll see you again. Uh, let me. Whoops! I forgot to get my keyboard over here, and without my keyboard, I can't do that. And without being able to do that, how am I supposed to end my episode? What problems, problems. Anyway, I hope you've had a good time watching this episode and uh, that you don't mind dropping a like, hitting subscribe, sharing with your friends, you know, all that stuff. And I hope you have a great day and take care. <laughs>